Jimmy, we've already interviewed Andy about today's game, but what are your thoughts about the match? Uh, pretty much the same as Andy's, I suppose. We worked all week on um, changing the shape a little bit and going 4 4 2. And um, with the heat and the weather, we decided um, to miss the middle of the park out as much as we could. And I think if you watch the game quite closely, you'll see that we, we, we went quite long to get, to get to the two forwards quick, um, which I thought worked. Um, Tyrrell obviously been awarded man of the match, so Tyrrell's done his bit. And I thought Matt Stenson's obviously ran his, ran his socks off. Uh, and then the other two have been supporting the two strikers very well. Charlie Dowd had a great game and, and Kane Richards outside this, this wing gear. He had a great game and I think uh, backed up by a very good midfield. And I want to pat the back four in the back. I thought Joe McGundry and Isaiah Osborne were fantastic. Kept uh, Adam Murray very quiet. Uh, and then the two full backs were brilliant, weren't they? Which is, is give Tony minimum to do. Cam McWilliams' goals is something that you probably won't better on match of the day tonight. So if we can get that out there on social media and, and you know, everyone see that goal, because it's, it's worth letting a lot of people see. Um, so delighted with the result. Results have gone our way, as, even though it's only the second game. There's five or six draws in the league, which is something I always look for. If we can get three points. So we move on, young Connor. Of course, um, Barwell next week. Big game against your former club. Uh, it's a rival game. Uh, local derby considered for the fans uh, what are your thoughts about that one? Well we've got Baseford first Tuesday night uh, who have won today so that'll be really really tough it's AstroTurf in this heat um, so the players are going to have to uh, make sure they're ready for an AstroTurf game which we ain't played on one yet this season um, and, and then we move on to Barwell everybody knows I was at Barwell for eight years and got fa fantastic friendship with the, the chairman Dave Lang and Colin Burton and, and, and everybody associated with Barwell um, even down to the, the guy that runs the bar, Craig Woodley, used to be my assistant manager. So the friendship's very, very strong. Um, we gave you three points last year so you could stay up. Um, you know, I don't think we'll be trying to give you three points this year, so it's a totally different ball game. But Ian King and Brian Burrows have gone in as the management. Um, they've got a very young side together. Uh, they play some fantastic, attractive football. He's got them playing, he's got them cooking. Um, so it's going to be a very, very good game. Um, the last twice or three times we've played Barwell here, we've touched a thousand crowds. So there's obviously an interest in the, the Jimmy at Barwell and, and Jimmy at Nuneaton now and Barwell coming to Nuneaton. So it's got a great ring to it and everybody seems to have a fantastic day. Um, we're very, very close friends. So I just hope it, it makes for an entertaining game, which the last two have, have been. And uh, good luck to Barwell. I've always got that feeling for Dave Lang and the group. but. Um, I'll be doing my best to see if we can get three points and I can't say the words, but bar well. Hopefully we can keep on going strength to strength. Thank you for the interview, Jimmy. Uh, no problem, mate. All the work you're doing behind the scenes, you guys, is fantastic. Along with all the... Uh, I want to I say a special mention today to that groundsman, Dave May, who's been here all week. Um, he's turned this pitch into something special. And uh, uh, I know he thinks I blow smoke up his backside quite regular, but, mate, what he's produced for us to be, to be able to play football on. Dave, you're a superstar, keep doing it. No, no trips to Portugal, Dave. Stay with Eaton Borough, love you. Thank you oh, Jim. sorry, can I one more, Matt? You Borough fans, it, it was great to see that we'd got a chit chat and sing song back in the corner. You're playing a massive part, mate. I'd love to get a thousand people in this gate and, and that corner over there that's been there for sort of like 12 years. The singing and, 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 and chanting today, was absolutely fantastic. Round your mates up and get everybody back. Listen, let's break the thousand crowd barrier next week against Barwell. Everybody turn up. Then Eaton versus Barwell. Let's break the thousand. Operation 1000. Come on, the borough.